Good morning, this is day three and we are at Castaway Key. Can you believe it? Such a beautiful day. Um, I'm probably gonna leave this camera in the cabin. I usually just vlog on my phone. I don't like to take this camera into the beach, but I have my phone and I have my GoPro, so hopefully I'll get some footage and I'll be able to include it in the vlog for day three. So come have some fun with us in Disney's private island of Castaway Key. Welcome to the splash pad. Not much. Oh, come on, seriously? I want one. Turn on, there's nobody here. All right, here's one. Watch it shut off when I go through. Yep. Ah, ah, oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Shut off. Today is not my day. Hello, now that I know how to use the GoPro, we can proceed to having fun in the splash pad. Yay! Whew. It is a hot day here. Whew. I'm going exploring with Daniel. You can go exploring with Daniel. Yes, please do so. That's the reason. The reason that we stayed in this area is for you to be able to use the slide as much as you can without having to walk a mile and we could I could actually see you guys. Pelicans plunge. Alright everybody. I'm finally alone. Don't know where the husband is. The kids went to the shop. I don't know. It's just been a day. I don't know if any of you any of you guys have teenagers, but dealing with teenagers is not easy. They uh, missed their curfew by two hours and a half yesterday. They got to the room at four o'clock in the morning, and I gave them a curfew of 1.30 to 2 o'clock, which I think is pretty reasonable. But they were not answering their phones, and we were up waiting for them until four o'clock in the morning, which was not ideal, not a good thing. I'm very upset with them today, and because of that, they have their consequences, which means that they're not allowed to leave our site after dinner. So, no going to the Vibe, no going to the team club. Might be a little harsh, but at this point, they need to understand that you just gotta follow the rules. I mean, I could give them a little bit of leeway, but it's just, they, uh, they took advantage, needless to say. I'm trying to make the most of the day, but uh <sighs> looks like I've been abandoned. But it's okay. I'm at Castaway Key, so I need to make I need to make my lemonade out of lemons. 
and what a place to make lemonade. Okay, so we're in the playa. Forget the vlogging in Spanish. We're in the beach. Just say hi. For two seconds. And there she is. Ship pressure. Wait, I can't get it. The kids are playing with their friends somewhere. Oh, there they go. The teenagers being teenagers. They have a group of people over there having fun. Say hi. And there's Pelican Plunge, which is two slides and a nice bucket of water. And this is the beach and the sandbar. And we're gonna go see if lunch is ready. Because that's what we do. So we gotta keep the feet right here. I don't have to touch the floor. I was cleaning my feet because they're full of sand, that's why. Paradise! I don't know how the rest of the time goes. Salt and bye, salt and bye. We ate, we conquered, and now we float. I got a guide. Guide me, says I Did the rain clouds go away? Did the rain clouds go away? Alright, this is the favorite part of my day. I have decided it right here, right now. The best $13 I ever spent. Back to the ship. Ooh, I'm shining. I'm sweating. Back to the ship. Back to the ship. Back to the ship. It has that. 
dividing one side and the other side. Yes, it's an acidity pool. Yes, it looks nice. But, no bueno. Two stars. Where are my kids? Oh, look, it was alive. It was a what? It was alive! The beetle is alive! Where are my kids? We left them in the island. Alright, I'm running out of battery. I did my rant. Two stars, I said. Two stars. I'm being generous. Two stars. It's an affinity pool. It's nice. It's different. But it would have made a great one if it would have been not to my way. The special horns are not yet. All right, we're leaving. Holy cow. I almost missed it because Daniel. That's my favorite Disney princess. Rapunzel halfway through doing my hair and we're leaving and I know there's gonna be crew members in this corner oh there they are saying goodbye Leaving since I have you here. Let me unzoom so you can look better. Sebastian, look over here. You're looking handsome. So are you, Daniel? Um, compare, rank your, rank your ships. Even though we haven't been Fantasy. on the Wonder. Fantasy. 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 I agree with that. You? Even though we've been on the Fantasy once, I think it's Fantasy superior. Extreme, magic Wonder. And where does the wish fall? Okay. So where does the wish fall? at the bottom. There right? is no glass elevators. No glass elevators. Elevators uh, are hot. The atrium is so small and it feels like tight when you're like down there, like all compact. And uh -huh. It doesn't feel open. For me. The one in the fantasy is so open. It feels like. Tight. The pools? There's so many more pools, but really little pools. The pool isn't that big of an issue. Five also, that's my issue. Five is so much better than fantasy. The edge is cooler here. The edge is cooler here? Yeah. How would you rank your your ships? The ships? Okay, fantasy, dream, um, wish, magic, and wonder, I guess. All right, we haven't been on the wonder, so it's not in the running. <laughs> okay, so really, you you think this is better than the magic? Yeah. How about the aqua, aqua mouse? Yeah. You like the aqua, uh, aqua duck, duck is better. Is better the aqua mouse didn't have a, a theme, a story, and the aqua duck does. What was I the story of the aqua mouse? The story that you see inside. What? What is the story? You're going into the shorts. Yeah, and you're just watching a movie. It's another thing to make shorts. Yeah, but it's not like oh, they constructed this. It's not a story about the slide. It's not about the ride anymore. It's about the story inside the ride. You're riding the ride to go see a story versus you're going to see a story about the ride on the other one. Okay. I, I still like the other one better. I don't like the aqua dunk. I've never, I did it once and I don't like those kinds of slides. But did anybody ride the yellow slide? No. I did. You did? Was it good? It's just the same as every other right here. Okay. Yellow slide. We're turning. We are turning. All right, I think I'm going to go back inside, finish my hair, finish getting ready, and uh, we'll see you at Arendelle. No. <laughs> Boys are going to love it. Oh, this is cute. Congratulations, Queen Anna and Chris. 
Oh, look at the woman's. Do you want to build a snowman? Look at the windows. It's too much. There's too much. I'm going too fast. <laughs> There's the men's bathroom. Look at this. Alright, my family's already left me, so let me go follow them. Excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me. Sorry, I was uh I was enthralled with all of this. <laughs> the theming is amazing. Anna and Elsa. Oh, I might have a little wine today. I hope we get a good seat, man. I want to see the show up close. Ah, I don't have a lot of faith. Alright, this is the menu for tonight in Arendelle. We have the royal family hereby welcomes you to an enchanted evening. It's a smorgasbord. There's ham tart. I might tread that carrot soup to try something different. For entrees, we have pork tenderloin, sea bass, meatballs, that sounds interesting, chicken breast, ribeye. Oh, they have double baked potato with the ribeye. <gasps> they do! That's your favorite! But I wanted to make the pork tenderloin. You know what? You can actually ask them to give you the pork tenderloin with the double baked potato and they'll do it for you. Oh, wait, I looked at the girl and I forgot to record. Trying to be adventurous. Did you like it? It's good? Alright. 
Salud, mi amor, salud. We had Elsa come to the table. And soon we'll have Olaf. And what's his name? Woo! What's his name? Elsa's a ghost. And anybody? Who says so she's not in love? Hello, new friends. Hello, Hi. Welcome. Thank you. Oh, oh yeah. Did you know water has memory? I did not know that. Huh? Yeah, it's true. The water that makes up you and me has passed through at least four humans and or animals before us. And remembers. That is most unsettling. <laughs> yep, we're all connected through water. <laughs> Weird, right? Uh, I think we should leave these fine people to their dinner. Bye, Olaf. Bye, friends. Enjoy your meal. Bye. It's doubled. The carbon doubled. Now it is, but it wasn't. It wasn't before? It's definitely gone through a lot more than just four people. I hope you're enjoying the party so far and it wasn't too far of a sleigh ride to get here. <laughs> <laughs> you can't trust your reindeer to get you where you need to go. My best friend Sven always says that. Thank you so much for celebrating with us. Have a good time. Thank you. Bye. Alright, carrot soup time. How'd you like it, Cesar? You said it's alright? Mm. I'll be the judge. You are the judge, Mom. It's not bad, but it's not great.
Pronounce that third one. It's a fresh cake. Signature dessert. Ooh. And Elsa's coronation sundae. Yesterday, Sebastian got with got a good uh, ice cream sundae. Today is not that day. Oh, it's oh maybe it's for me. All right, I'll take that. But the signature dessert, I was gonna take it until I saw pistachio. I'm not a fan of pistachio. You know, for the memes, you can get nothing. What? You can get nothing for the memes. Okay, for the memes. Here's the celebration Sunday. And the butter cake. Oh, butter cake, that's what it was. We'll try that. The kids are invisible. They turned into spirit ghosts. All right. Arendelle, so far this would be my favorite, followed by 1923, and third would be Marvel. Mm. Nope, we're good. Andy Momo would love this. Mint chocolate chip. Back now. <laughs> Moana. Moana. <laughs> watch Ariel, the little mermaid. Look how pretty. Oh, focus. Let's see if I can get it to focus. Treasures untold. How many wonders can this cavern hold? Well, there's no electronic devices allowed, so I can't record, but I will let you know how it is. I'm pretty sure it will be wonderful. But let's take one last look at the Walt Disney Theater. <sighs> it kind of gives me Princess and the Frog vibe. the humid balcony. Little Mermaid, I must admit, I fell asleep. I was so tired for waiting up for my kids yesterday that got to the cabin at 4 a.m. Oh my gosh. Um, yeah, I left halfway through the show. Oh, I told you, humidity is real. I left halfway through that show. Uh, it was, from what I saw, it was a great show. I mean, nothing to say about the show. I was just tired and decided to come up here to finish packing. Uh, on Disney Cruises, if you don't know, you have to pack um, as much as you can and leave your baggage, your luggage outside the door by 10.30 p.m. And then they will take them and make sure that you receive them uh, once you're off the ship. And that's just to make the debarkation process a little bit more seamless and we need to be at breakfast at the same place we had dinner today which was Arendelle. We need to have breakfast at Arendelle at 7 a.m. Uh, and then after 7 a.m. we would be able to leave the ship. 
Uh, the plan is to leave early because uh, I have to work tomorrow and Cesar actually has to travel for work tomorrow and his flight leaves at 1. So we are going to leave early enough. That being said, I might combine, I'm not sure yet, depending on how long this vlog is, I might combine today's vlog and add in the debarkation. I don't know yet, we'll see. But if you see a debarkation one, it'll probably be a very short one. Uh, but uh, it was just gonna be us leaving the room, saying goodbye, we'll probably take a few pictures in the balcony before we leave and head out for breakfast and just leave the ship as soon as we are able to do so. Uh, that being said, if I'm gonna give you my overall thoughts, and this is not just me, I spoke to a lot of people today on the elevator, in the adult pool when I was with Cesar, and also uh, uh, at dinner time, the people who were sitting next, next to us, the people who were sitting next to us also expressed the same, the same things. That this is the exciting part of the ship is that it was a new ship, especially for people like us who've been on a few already. It was a new ship. It was exciting to explore and to see what they had and how many things were different. But I believe the fantasy and the dream have a lot more to offer even though they're a little bit smaller than this one. Like there was no midship detective, there was no mini golf. And that's not to say that we actually need that because maybe, you know, maybe they took those things away to put something different and that gives you other options to do different things. I get that. But the rooms were hot. You can tell that the servers are still not in their A game. Uh, some of the entertainment were still a little faulty. There was a lot of sound issues yesterday at the deck party. Um, so, you know, being that this is just like the third official uh, voyage of this uh, ship, you know, it was it, it, it still has a lot to to um, it has a lot to get polished out. It needs, it, it needs more practice, more voyages, and probably in a few, maybe two years or so, it'll probably get much better. That being said, I don't know if we will choose the wish for our next Disney cruise. Now that Sebastian's turning 18 in January of next year, it'll be a little bit different for us in regards to cruising. I don't know, I think we might take a little break on that. We still need to do the wonder. That's kind of a dream of ours is to actually do an Alaskan cruise. So I don't know if that is going to happen. And if it does, it'll probably be in about two years or so. Uh, but you know, there will be other vacations and other things that I would like to take you guys along with. I hope you enjoyed what you saw so far. And um, thank you for watching and for being a part of this community. With that being said, I want to wish everybody a good night. I am about to go downstairs and give my final goodbye. I'll probably take some pictures before I leave. This is it for the vlog tonight. Have a good night and thank you for watching. Bye. Good morning from embarkation day. Good morning. This is debarkation day. Blah. Seven o'clock in the morning. We're late for breakfast and everybody's ready to go. Let's do this. Here we are. Back at Arendelle for breakfast. Let's see if I can go slower this time. Or maybe not. Yeah, people behind. Okay. I love this. This is my favorite restaurant. Elsa has frozen the windows. The men's bathroom. Oh, people are leaving their bags here. All right, let's go to breakfast. Cheers, everybody.
We made it. We made it through. <laughs> All right, Daniel, let's start with you. What was your favorite thing about the whole cruise? <laughs> what? The vibe? How about you? Last night. Last night? So it's the last night that's your favorite thing, huh? Yeah. You almost didn't make it to last night. We had a change of heart. But I'm glad that you guys came came back to the room on a decent time because it wasn't it's not easy waking up. So I was fall out. I didn't even feel you. How about you, Cesar? What was your favorite thing? Castaway key. Castaway key? What is it about Castaway Key that you like? Oh, me, the no, it just, I dropped it so That's true. I uh, I think I enjoyed Castaway Key the most. And the dinner last night. I had I had a good time at dinner last night at this restaurant. I like the show. I like the woohoo. Woo um, and this whole theming of this restaurant was one of my favorite things. Ooh, sorry. The theming. I got little arms. That's why like I they hurt. I don't have reach. Uh, so, my favorite thing was this restaurant and the dinner last night and the show and being able to see all the characters and Olaf. And the, that was one of my favorite things. And last night, being able to shop around again and um, although I didn't take a lot of pictures, I took a lot of videos, so hopefully I'll be able to uh, screenshot something to get a good um, family photo. <laughs> okay, so with that being said, I'm going to have breakfast now. I'm going to enjoy the last breakfast and we will record a little bit later in the Grand Hall as we do the debarkation and then back home, back to work. So, so long, and we hope to see you real soon. Man, I took half of that home. Well, thank you, Captain Mickey. Here we go. My wish. Yes. Bye. Bye. Oh, really? Yep. Got the support canal. Bye bye, wish. Welcome to the family. Bye This is a Disney. Welcome, family. This is just straight up a Disney Plus ad. The last goodbye. It was great. Oh, our room. We could almost see our room from here. All the way in the back. Bye, Wish. And with that, it's over. It's done. See you next time. Uh, Bye. Bye. Thank you for watching. Hopefully, there'll be a next one. Hopefully. Subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. Listen to Cesar. Everybody has to listen to Cesar. Everybody. Thank you. Everybody. Bye. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button. Goodbye.